guys, Fedgigators. So we are starting these new video chat sessions called uh, Professional Problem Solving Sessions, PPS for short. And the idea came about from speaking with Carrie, who is a Chicago Public School special education teacher. And Carrie, how about you tell us about your idea that we are now turning out into an online format? So the idea came from my classroom when I was having some difficulties with some behaviors and just some of my teaching. And I really wanted a network of people to talk to in my school um, about what was going on. And we didn't have any kind of structured, formal place to go. So um, that's how the idea came to Cindy. Um, originally, I wanted people that were strong in reading and writing and in math to volunteer their expertise to younger teachers who might be struggling. And so since it never took off at my school, I came to the educators with it. Great. So this is how it's going to work. So we have first a speducator poses a problem. So they will be emailing uh, speducatorsnetwork at gmail.com and in the, the subject line write PPS session. And so it could be any problem like Carrie was talking about. It could be uh, wanting to plan a unit. It could be uh, a challenging behavior that a child is presenting. Anything that you're facing could be a graduate student, a doctoral student, uh, maybe about research, or it could be a teacher, a principal, anybody. So they'll email that problem to us. That's for the second part of this, we will be recruiting uh, experts out there. We call experts as in it's anyone that self-identifies that they feel like they have experience in this area. And it, it will be posted to our Facebook group with the problem and the first two to three speducators who volunteers to contribute to this video chat session will be recruited and they will then be sent an email uh, with the further details on the case. And then we will be sending out a doodle to schedule a time to do the video chat with the the, the SPED educators that will be contributing with one of the SPED net officers who will be taking notes and facilitating the discussion and also the original SPED educator who posed the problem. So third, we will be having this video chat discussion. It will be facilitated by a SPEDNA officer, and it will just be a quick discussion gathering expertise and ideas on how to solve that problem posed by that original speducator. And the SPEDNA officer will record those notes with uh, the original problem, the ideas that are generated, and, and then the original speducator will create an action plan about the steps that make sense for them to solve that problem based on the ideas that were generated. So all this information in the fourth step will will be posted to our website and it will be include the video, the notes from the session, and any resources that are mentioned. That's it. So all of that will be included on our website at speducatorsnetwork.org. So Carrie, do you have anything else you'd like to add? Yeah, one more thing. I just wanted to let everybody know that this is going to be a quick process. These conferences will only be about five, ten minutes long, just like a conversation. I know when we explain it, it sounds a little bit longer, but it's only going to take about five to ten minutes to all those educators volunteering their time. Great. All right, we can't wait to get started, and we will see you soon. Bye.